We're hanging out at the Heart and Stroke Foundation. Right now, I'm joined by Kirby. Now, Kirby is a very important person to talk to because he has actually gone through a personal experience with heart disease and a heart attack. So, Kirby, tell us your story. How, what happened? Uh, it was just a, a day in March, 10 years ago, that, in fact, and uh, I was playing hockey and got lightheaded on the ice, and next thing you know, I passed out and my heart had stopped. Wow. And, uh, you know, was uh, was playing the, the city police team. Mm -hmm. They were quick to act. They gave me CPR, and then they also went and got the uh, AED from, the, from the, the rink, and that's what made me survive today. Wow. And so for people who don't know what an AED is, what is it? I think it's automatic external defibrillator. Yeah. Basically what you see on TV when you watch uh, doctor shows, they, they shock you back to life, basically is what it is. Yeah. So what was running through your mind when you woke up from such a situation and there's probably people around yeah, you and you know, chaos? I was, I, was, I was really like, okay guys, enough messing around, like I got to get back to work. I'm a chartered accountant. <laughs> March is a busy time of year, so I was just thinking, let's get back to work and go back to normalcy, not really knowing the severity is what what had just happened to me. And I'd like to point out, talking about how you're so involved with hockey, you have been active all through your life, so did you ever think something like this could happen to you? You know, absolutely not. You're, uh, you're, you're, you're feeling bulletproof, 34 years old. You know, I, I got to the hospital and, and have, have learned a couple stories. There was a, a person in, the, uh, in North Vancouver the same night I was, mm -hmm. went down, same affliction, mm. passed away because there was no AED on site. Mm. Um, when I was in the hospital in Calgary, um, there was a 17-year-old boy from Drayton Valley wow. passed away from the same sort of thing. So, anybody. Just like that. Yeah. Yeah, wow, that's crazy. So, you have used the Heart and Stroke Foundation. So, how has the foundation really helped you? Well, uh, I guess they, they've, they've been working along with the Heart Safe program to yeah. get the AEDs. They've, they've got over, I think, 6,000 in rinks and sports facilities and, and buildings in Canada now. So, Perfect. they're really getting that message out to how important they are and really all I can do is say, it saved me, it could save you. Yeah, it saved me, it could save you. That's a great thing to end on. Well, thanks so much, Kirby. There's lots more information coming up your way here on Shaw TV, so make sure you don't go anywhere and keep watching today's Go Saskatoon.